Now that I have two bolts tightened at each corner so the crib is being held up on its own square and straight, uh, it's time to add the mattress support. To add the mattress support, you'll see that there are these wings that come off the ends of them, of it. Um, these little wings have holes in them where the nuts go through and into the hardware. The height of the mattress is adjustable with this hardware. You can see there's four different adjustments. One, two, three, and four. So for an infant um, just born, it's probably likely you're going to want it on the highest setting. That way you don't have to reach over as far uh, on the, from the edge of the crib to put the child in and pick the child up out of there. So for this demonstration, I will put in the mattress support at the highest uh, knob. And again, same bolts, just goes right through the hole in the mattress support and into this hole too. When I put the mattress support in, I'm going to put it with the flat side up. This is the side that's going to contact the mattress, the flat side with these rivets here in the corners. I don't want to put it on the underside like this, where there's an indentation. We want to keep this flat at the top. 